It was cleanup day around Albuquerque after spring wind tore through the area. Trees and power lines took a beating, while parts of the west side are buried under mountains of tumbleweeds. News 13's Alex Goldsmith is live in Ventana Ranch with the story. Alex. Well, Jessica, the winds this afternoon have really started to whip up, ramping up, blowing around tumbleweeds. If you look over this way, you can see where the problem was. Out into the desert, the tumbleweeds rolling in, scooped up by heavy winds, and sent over into this neighborhood, piling up in front of a lot of homes. This is the worst. This is the worst I've seen it in 10 years. Nancy Roth's walled in backyard in Ventana Ranch West has been turned into a giant basket of tumbleweeds stacked up to her roof. I was trying to at least clear a little space so my poor dog could get out, but I can't even I can't even open open the door. She's not alone. This truck down the block was buried. Whoever lives here will have to fight past an avalanche of tumbleweeds just to get out of their driveway. They were carried in here yesterday by winds that blew through it up to 60 miles an hour and made an absolute mess out of the west side. It's a problem without an easy solution. We have no idea. We're out of ideas. I mean, what do you, you know, national disaster? Does anybody come along and go, uh, would you like us to, to take this away? And getting hit with a tumbleweed in the face? That's like the worst. This pile of tumbleweeds was the daunting task landscaper Jesse Moore faced today. We have uh, five guys coming to help us. Uh, we'll be here the rest of the day and probably won't finish. So it takes a while. While he was armed with a pitchfork, city crews brought out the big guns. Out off of Trisco Vista, they used rollers to crush tumbleweeds and bulldozers to scoop up what was left to clear the way. No help like that on private property, but some tried to look on the bright side anyway. The one nice thing, the house is pitch dark in the middle of the day because there's no light coming in at all. It's good for, it lets you sleep, that's for sure. Now, a lot of neighborhood neighbors told me today they didn't see the point in trying to clear out too many of these tumbleweeds. That's because with these winds still whipping up, more and more of these tumbleweeds just keep blowing in. Back to you. All right, thank you, Alex. Elsewhere in the city, it was fallen tree branches that kept parks and rec crews busy today. In some cases, chainsaws were needed to slice up the debris. We get a lot of reports through 311, which is really helpful, but we also just have the crews out checking on parks where we know we have older trees, where we know we can expect to find things. Meanwhile, this man in Martinez town has to figure out how to clean up this big tree after it crashed down onto his property. It just missed doing serious damage to his brother-in-law's truck. It says he usually parks a car where the bulk of the tree fell over, so he's feeling especially lucky today.